The battle for Buffalo City Hall has now officially intensified. A newly energized Mayor Byron Brown is launching his writing candidacy for mayor. And a determined and equally spirited India Walton is pressing forward as the Democratic nominee. We heard from both this evening. Two on your side's Ron Plants brings us their political perspectives as this campaign has just restarted for November. Perhaps it was a sign of this most unusual campaign as the current mayor, Brown, found doors initially locked at the Statler for his announcement, but eventually found a way in and now seems to have found his way with this to reporters on the primary. I take full responsibility. I apologize uh, to the voters. Um, uh, I can't go back. I can all only go forward. And with his claim of thousands of supporters urging him on, Brown made it official. We are going on to the general election as a candidate for mayor. And what people have been saying is write down Byron Brown. But the party's presumptive nominee says she and her campaign are ready. And India Walton will not back down. I didn't take any days off after the primary. Our campaign team uh, continued to work, and we are ready to mobilize not only our base, but spread our broader message of caring for working people. We are assembling a very strong team. We're bringing people from all over the country and resources in to run a competitive race. So uh, to that I say, game on. And now, gloves off. You know, we know the difference between socialism and democracy. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. We are going to fight for democracy in the city of Buffalo. Yes, the voters have said that they don't want an unqualified, inexperienced, radical socialist trying to learn on the job on the backs of the residents of this community. We will not let it happen. I am a democratic socialist. The first word in that is democrat. My policies are socialist policies. Um, many things that we enjoy during the pandemic, like our economic stimulus, like SNAP benefits for families with children, like free health care. I'm looking forward to listening tours and talkbacks and also doing some political education to really uh, relax some of the fears when we use the dog whistle term socialist. And frankly, the, the attacks have already come and people like Carl Palladino, who are, have been longtime supporters of the mayor, we know are behind this. And, uh, you know, I just hope that my supporters and my community will really rally around me. So now it really begins. Ron Plants, Channel 2 News.